In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a Google form and embed it in your class website. So what I want you to do is create some kind of survey or background knowledge probe or something to that effect uh, that you can use with your students. So here's what we do. We start at Google Docs. So go to docs, D-O-C-S, dot Google dot com. You'll end up on a page that looks something like this, although I may have more documents than you do. And then we're going to go over to this big red Create button. It should look familiar. From the list that pops up, we're going to choose Form. So Create and then Form. All right. Now we're going to start with a title for the form. So this may be um, Culture Topics, or it could be you know what they want for rewards or any kind of things. Okay. So I'm going to say, help me decide which countries we should study for our culture lessons this term. And I could have a question like, which country would, countries would you like to study? choose all that apply. So basically what we're doing is setting up a question. Now Google Forms will not grade this, so it won't be like a quiz, although there is a little thing we can add on to it to make it grade. I'll show you that later, another time. Um, but this is really just to gather information from the students. What do they already know? What do they want to study? What would they like for, for a reward? Stuff like that. Uh, not to grade, okay? So I'm just asking them which countries they want to study, choose all that apply, and then we get here to the question type, uh, and right now it's set to text, so that would just be a little text box that they respond to. We can do paragraph text, multiple choice, check boxes, choose, etc. Okay, so I'm going to do check boxes because that will allow me to uh, have them choose more than one, and I'm going to say Mexico and Guatemala and Chile, and Colombia, and Spain. <laughs> Spain. There we go. I can decide whether I want that to be a required question or not, so they can't move on until they're done with it, and then I click Done. Okay, so it's really easy to set up these questionnaires, okay? Uh, they have a sample question too in here. You can use that. You can ask as many questions as you want. If you want to add more, you just come up here to add item. Now the other option here is the theme. Right now it's plain, so it's just going to be nice and kind of boring. <laughs> you can choose another one, but try to make it consistent with the website that you have. So I'm going to come here. I'm going to delete this sample question too so it doesn't show up on my survey. And then I'm going to make sure I've saved. All right. Now I'm going to come back here to my class website. And I'm going to add a page uh, that is for this survey specifically. So I'm doing culture survey. Leave it as a web page template. Keep it at the top level. Okay. We're just keeping things really simple on this site. Create that page. And guess what we're going to do? We're going to go to insert because we're putting something in the page. And then we just choose, again, because they're all integrated right here, spreadsheet form. So that's the one we need. It'll give me a list of the different forms I have available. So I'm going to choose my culture topics survey I just made, select it. And then I can decide how big I want it. I find 400 pixels, which is the default, to be too narrow. So I'm going to set it to 600, or if you wanted, you could just leave it empty, uh, and it would be as wide as your page, and that would be just fine too. Height also, same deal. All right, save it. You get the ugly gray box, that's normal. Click Save again, and then you'll see your survey. All right, that's it for adding a Google Form to your class website.